welcome to vlogmas day four um so as y'all can see we're in the car we're about to be running some errands and i have you on my handheld um camera thing and i have you on my handheld camera you know what is this thing called stabilizer or handle <laughs> because um i have a car mount for my phone here look this thing that thing yeah i have that and it's right there where i would normally put my camera um so i have to hold it for right now and it's super super dark i don't know why it's so dark right now maybe because i'm facing against the sun i don't know i hope you guys can see but anyways um it is saturday it's Saturday. So you guys will be seeing this on Sunday. And I am out running some errands, um, like we normally do. <laughs> you know, when you're a mom, you're an adult, This that's just, it just becomes your life. Like, that's just the end all be all. So I have a crap load of things that I have to do. So just some things that we have to do, guys. We have to get some wrapping paper for presents under the Christmas tree, of course. I'm looking for specifically Grinch. Ah! Oh my God. My car mount thing is like, oh my God, y'all look. The thing just like came, it's not sticking down anymore. All of a sudden. What the hell? You know what? It's 89 degrees outside on December 3rd. Like. That's crazy, 89 degrees on December 3rd. That's, I think that's why it's not sticking because it's so hot outside and it's been up there for maybe four months, three months, four months, I don't know. But you would think Amazon would have better quality things to where it'll last a lot longer than two or three months. So, I don't know, maybe I have to wipe it down with some water. But anyways, we just pulled up to Dollar General we just pulled up to Dollar General and I am about to, let me put this here, hold on. Like you guys can see. Okay. So you guys, um, I just pulled up to Dollar General. So here are the things that we have to do. I don't, I'm sure you can hear me, but that's it, my AC. Okay, so we have to get wrapping paper. Like I said, I want specific wrapping paper for Grinch theme because that's what the Christmas tree is. That's what the whole theme is this year. So that's we just want to stay on the theme. If not Grinch um, wrapping paper, we can go like with the Grinch colors, you know, like the bright neon greens and stuff like that. That'll do fine. So we're going to be looking for that. And then I have to get laundry detergent, which is why I'm at the Dollar General. Um, I have to go to the hair store because I'm taking these braids down. Finally, <laughs> we're taking these braids down, honey. Um, I, I have, I bought myself two watches and I want to go get them fixed. Um, not fixed, but like take links at them so they can fit like this one. You know, this one fits perfectly. It's a little tight at times, but you know, it fits my wrist. Um, and then I need to go get um a few christmas gifts i want to get my toes done because if you don't know my birthday's coming up um and just because you know that's womanly maintenance that's what we need to go do um and then i want to also find a powder foundation so those are all the things that we have to do today so let's go okay y'all i'm lying i lied first of all oh shoot first of all why do I always forget the freaking coupons? The freaking coupons when I go in this store. Oh my God, I hate that. I freaking got, oh, I got the laundry detergent and it was like 16 bucks and I, and they always have, they always have coupons for the laundry detergent at the Dollar General and I always forget, always. And that sucks. 
but anyways also guys so we have to i have to go i have to go ship oh my god i could have saved three dollars i could have saved three dollars on my on my uh laundry detergent i wonder if i can scan like do the receipt thing and get my money back for it oh man anyways um so yeah guys i have to go and drop off i have to go ship this thing that was left at my house for thanksgiving hope we can get everything done today because it's already 2 30 and it gets dark at 5 30 so i have three hours to run across town so let's go y'all oh my god do you hear that i'm gonna show you how festive and holiday ish just puts me in the spirit this just puts me back in the spirit because because freaking ulta also just also just try to take me out of my holiday spirit so i went in there to exchange i went in there to exchange my um my bronzer pad right and the lady tried to give me a hard time i went to the same cashier that i went to last week and she was looking at me like i was trying to steal something and i'm like Okay, granted, you might not remember me from last week because you, you work in retail. You probably see thousands of people, hundreds of people every day. However, this is a makeup store. Y'all can return stuff if people used it. You know, it, it doesn't matter. Like, she was like, I have to get my manager. You know, what's your phone number? We looked at my phone number. Use the same phone number I used last time. And... She said, oh, it's n it's nowhere, it's not traceable. Now granted, she wasn't like all hostile or anything like that, but I could just feel the vibe. Like she was, she didn't know, either she didn't know what she was doing or she was looking at me some kind of way like, I can't, I'm not gonna be able to do this for you because it's not traceable. Well, ma'am, here's the glitch in your niche because this wasn't my fault. <laughs> I came with the receipt in the bag the last time, you know? if we have to you guys can pull the cameras and see that you were the cashier that actually made the mistake so she had to go get her manager her floor manager her floor manager had no issue he went in the system trying to um you know do the proper exchange so it can be traceable why it wasn't traceable last time i don't know because i signed a receipt and everything so it should be in your system um he didn't know how to do it so then he had to call i guess the store manager and she came and knocked it out of the bag right away then the cashier says medium she put a bag she provided a receipt and i signed the same receipt that i signed last time i signed this time so also y'all need come on now can we do better please like I just, I, I don't like the fact, it was so busy. This shopping center place is always so busy. And I don't like the fact that this was not a seamless transaction. This should be a seamless transaction if you guys are able to return things that are used and you, you have a policy that you can, I'm not even, I don't want money back. I wasn't asking for a refund or anything like that. I just wanted to simply get the shade that I, that's that matches me. So yeah that was that <sighs> and another thing let's let's just have a quick conversation regarding uh traffic in a shopping center and pedestrian etiquette let's just let's just have that conversation because it's like i told y'all before like florida is the number one spot for people moving to right about now and it's a whole bunch of people that are not originally from here that have moved here from different states and different sides of the United States, right? And I don't know who raised y'all, but listen, baby, if you see me, if you see a moving car and you are a pedestrian walking in the road, you need to stop and exit stage left and let that moving car proceed to where it needs to go before, you know, steer clear, steer clear 
of cars that are in motion. Like, who who raised you guys? Seriously, like this is this is insane. I'm trying to back out of the parking spot and the lady's walking as if she don't see my car backing out. You were nowhere in sight when I was backing out. You were nowhere in sight. You were way over there. And as I'm slowly backing out because I'm not trying to hit anyone in sight, how are you still walking and my car was backing out first? You're walking up on my car. So that means you stop, allow me to back out, and then you go. Not you speed up faster as I'm backing out because you want me to stop so you can still walk to your car. That's not how that work. Like, girl! It's just... Hopefully this is a better day. Hopefully this day gets better. You know, because it just, it's, it's uh, you know, uh, what am I trying to say? Spit it out. Uh, you can tell a lot of people, you can tell the, you can tell the people that aren't from here is what I'm trying to say. You can tell the people that aren't originally from Florida or this area because they do not have that Southern hospitality. They feel entitled. They feel, you know, obligated as if you are to cater to them. I don't, I don't, it's... <sighs> Do y'all experience that in other states, in other countries? Like, this is insane. We are kind, we are nice, we are thoughtful, we are considerate, you know? If I see someone walking, I'm gonna stop and let you go. If I'm backing out and I see there's a family trying to pass by because they were near and they stopped, I'm going to stop because they stopped. They felt it not robbery to stop and let me go. So I'm going to be kind because I have the moving vehicle to stop and let them go clear out of my vision before anything else. But anyways, my battery about to die. I gotta change my battery. So I will see you guys when I see y'all. We just need to slow the motion. Don't get that away to no one. Long distance, I need you. When I see potential, I just gotta sit through. If you had a twin, I would still choose you. I don't wanna rush into it if it's too soon, but I know. This is my bowl, y'all. I forgot to show y'all before, before I started eating it, but this is what it looks like. Acai bowl, traditional at nature's table. But yeah, guys, so I'm headed to the hair store now. Um, I just picked up a little snack, as you can see here. So I'm driving and eating at the same time. So I'm gonna put this down and I will see you guys when we get to the hair store, okay? So yeah, guys, we made it back home. Oh, let me try to prop you guys. Well, I didn't even get much. I did not even get much at all. Um, Pretty much just, maybe this is a better view. This is what I wore. Don't mind this stuff, it's just my house shoes and a receipt. But yeah, guys. Tennis shoes. But anyway, so this is what I got from the hair store. I didn't end up getting any hair. I bought my shoes, I didn't go get my toes done. This is the, um, the product, uh, Juvia's Place Bronzer, Medium Deep. I went to go switch this out. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'm gonna go ahead and shower, and why am I always orange every time I'm in here? Like, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go ahead and shower and um, freshen up and try to decide if we're gonna go ahead and go to these Christmas lights or not. If we do, I will see you guys there. And if not, I will see you guys tomorrow or Vlogmas Day, whatever, five. <laughs> Bye. We're back. So we're getting ready to go see Christmas lights. So it is actually like a drive-through Christmas light type of thing. 
Um, I think it's just like real quick drive through. It's probably not even, it's probably like five to 10 minutes long, if even that. But um, yeah, I just figured we'll go do something festive for this Saturday night. I'm gonna try to do something festive every weekend up until Christmas. I mean, that's kind of like what you do. I already missed my hometown's Christmas parade. That was this morning. I had no idea. Freaking sucks. Um, so I'm gonna try to find another Christmas parade. Not one where I live now because y'all see how that went last year. No. <laughs> but we'll see. Um, and this is just a Christmas light drive through. So we don't even have to get out of the car. We're not walking anywhere or anything like that. So that's what we're getting ready for. And I just put on my, uh, like, I don't even know if you can see, but my sweatpants, cause we're not getting out of the car. Like, why am I getting it all cute and stuff? And then I just put on this like, um, black and look, I, uh, anyways, just this like black t-shirt. So anyways, I am trying to, um, so I got this stuff, this uh, Sulfur 8 medicated dandruff for braids that I want to try to use on my hair because that's the reason why, oh my God, you guys can't even see. Anyway, so that, because that's the reason why like my hair is like not lasting the way that I want it to because it's been like itching crazy and uh what I thought this was like okay so it says affected area so we're just spraying at the top we're just gonna spray at the top then because I really don't want to take out these rays y'all I really don't I really really don't want to take out these rays because I literally, I think it just made, I had these in a month today. And um, it's just crazy because, oh, it's dripping. I, you know, these are knotless braids and I wanted to wear these for the remainder of the year, but the way my hair was itching and dandruff came up, I'm like, I don't get dandruff, what is this? All right, where the dandruff was. Let me know what y'all use for like dandruff on protective hairstyles. Just let me know. So I'm just gonna wash my hands and um, get ready to go and I'll see you guys at the drive-through Christmas lights.